it, folks. That confirms it. He is a druggie. <laughs> druggie now. Druggie. Woodstock. Two more days of peace and music. And read. <laughs> two, more, two more days. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of Ward Hall, <laughs> the University of Brighton is born. <laughs> Welcome to the Rough Guide oh. to New York City. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, blame me. And welcome to my train timetable. The next train departing from New York Penn Station, bound for Stuart Manor. The pilots at 11:31. Okay, tell us. These guys. Are, we've just spotted these two guys on New York on Fifth Avenue, just moments away from where we were a second ago. Oh boy, that's tough. Oh. Is that nail polish on your fingernails? It's white out. White out. What are you doing? Are you doing Type some sort of gothic? That's yeah. Tipex for all you English people, not white out. Tipex. That's snow paper, snow paper, Tipex, liquid paper, you name it. It's the mark of a frustrated writer. <laughs> oh, you're both writers. I am. He is. Sort of, yeah. What do you write? Oh, bad things. Play interviews trash. in the rain. <laughs> trash. <laughs> Great trashy novels. Trashy novels. <laughs> <laughs> With lots of sex and drugs and rock and roll. Yes. My name yes. is Chris. Chris, hi Chris, and Jenny. Jenny, hi Jenny, hi Chris. This is very, this is very delightful. I mean, the couple in love, or, or the couple in uh, dustbin liners. Married, oh engaged. You wear no. the same clothing. Would you like uh, to propose this woman on TV right now? Yes, this is great. I would love it if this was on TV right now. In fact, what can we say that's memorable, significant? Singing in the rain. You've not got any socks on. Oh, do we have an Aguila? Let's find a big puddle. We need a puddle, though. Uh, is that one right there? Oh, there's one on that corner. That's okay. Oh, do I come over here and have an Aguila? Oh, you have to stay out of the rain. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's too bad. We can do it right here. Okay, we can do it right here. But you can do it in that rain just there. All right, I'll get out here. We're gonna dance. Rough guys. Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Nagila, hey, Mana, Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Nagila, hey, Mana, Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Nagila, Hoppa, Oh, yeah, it's pleasure, it was guys. nice meeting you guys and uh, just shake your hand here Very and good. wish you good luck. You're doing an excellent job. You're Thanks very professional. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Nice and to meet you. Good, good luck with your writing and uh, everything. Thank you. Thank you. Sure. And we'll and remember this day for the rest of our lives. That's right. And this is the residence. This is your residence right here. Yes. yes. It's wonderful. It's, it's like a prison. It's very much state, of power yeah. and crazy. You should go up there. So, okay. I'm sure you can buy drugs there if you want to, but it's not like the old... I mean, it's not like even five years ago. No. It's, it's really changed. It's become much like less Do you heavy think New York is a nice place to live? It's a nice place to live? Yeah. Oh, it's fantastic. It's my favorite place to live in. What about all the uh, violence? And the I don't even think of it, to be quite honest with you. The dirt? I don't even think of it. Subways? Doesn't even. I love it. In fact, that's why I'm here. You saw it. it. The it's not so. It's not. So, well, it doesn't have to be that way. Uh, I've, I've met more nice people. Okay, I'm from Boston, Boston area. Boston. No, this may be off the record, whatever. But I really think that this is from Boston. Down Boston. That's why with the rough guy people. All right. But I think Boston is a nice place. <laughs> but I think that I think that I've met more really genuinely good, nice people here than in Boston. I Such think, as us. I think that Pudex. I think that Boston. people are much more open to <laughs> different experiences, living their lives differently here living lives they really, really want to live their lives and following us convention in New York City. And that's why I think that all of these things, the rush and the hustle and the bustle, the minute you slow down and you pause one person to smile at them and you're nice to them, all of a sudden, like, worlds happen. It's really. a whole new world. It really is. It's yeah, funny because, I mean, sir, there are plenty of assholes. There are plenty of real dicks and people who are in a rush. And, but, 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 if you just spend 10 minutes looking You'll find that some of the greatest people ever concentrated right in this little area, from 14th Street down to Soho, east to west villages. This is, this is where it's yeah, all happening. That's a good place. Really, this is where it's all about. Below, below 14th is better. I Greenwich think. Village. Exactly. Greenwich Village. Yeah, really that's where it is. Village, no west Village. This is the middle. I mean, this is a little, this is really historically speaking a money area, and I mean, look at the buildings. They're huge. It's very faceless. Um, not much character compared to when you go to the village scenes. It feels much more like a European town, don't you think? 